Carr, quick wave to his cheering fans. New video today of Johnny Depp in the UK where he's celebrating the verdict. You already know the BC and thing for Clarence don't make sense. Shout out to Johnny Depp for winning this case. It's not just a win for Johnny Depp. It's a win for all us men across the world because uh, there's a lot of men right now being falsely accused. Got accusations just because female nature, just because of Me Too movement, the feminist movement, because everybody is so quick to believe a woman because they're always constantly victimized. They want to play the victim role, but at the same time, want to be a man. They want the same powers. They want the same type of treatment as a man until you actually treat it like a man. And then they're constantly back. Now they revert back into that female state. That submissive state. All the things she made up about Johnny Depp doing the case was false. But she constantly tried to make this man look like a predator. But at the same time, females around the world want to constantly say, I'm a boss. I'm just that in the third. But when it comes time to be a man, when it's time to show masculinity, they run and hide. So this is good, not just for Johnny, but this can be conducive to somebody like uh, Tory Lanez as well. This will give everybody that ability to think outside of the box when it comes to Tory Lane's case coming up with Megan Thee Stallion. Because you can think about it like this, okay. We just can't believe what women are saying. Just because a man is say through or he doesn't want to deal with the situation anymore, a woman can easily cry wolf and you're going to run and believe her because of this day and age. But this is, this is a, definitely a huge win. I'm glad that he triumphed. In this case, because now this opens the eye of many individuals who didn't really think this way, who thought that, you know what, there's only one type of way. There's only uh, women that are victims and men that are predators. But now you can see, stop trying to be a man. Stop trying to betray a man persona, but you can't handle the things that come with being a man. See, this is the funny thing. It's like it's like a hypocrite. It's like you constantly want the same duties, the same responsibilities. You want the title of what men have but then when it comes time to actually be a man you can't do it that's why in these cases we got to be look at all this boss was you know boss bitch shit like with megan and stallion and all this bullshit that she said in her songs but now she want to come on gail king and cry about it and lie about a relationship that she had with tori but this is the funny thing though this is what you got to deal with but johnny depp has opened the eyes of you know a lot of people that just meek that sleep now they get to see reality. Now they get to see what, you know what? This is this is going to be a constant shift and a change what's going on because men are getting tired. We're getting tired of constantly being portrayed as something that we're not.